Hello! You're back! Oh, it's great to see you here at Northworthy Sagas and Stories, whilst I put my sword away. Now, as you know, I am Broggy, the son of Magnar, and I'm a Viking warrior, and a teller of stories, folk tales. And today, I have an English folk tale for you. And the folk tale is called The Hedge Priest. Now, our story is set in the county of the five boroughs of Derbyshire and is about a priest, and not just any priest, an Irish priest. And although this folk tale is a little bit later than the times of the Saxons and the Vikings, I'm going to put this folk tale back in this time. Now, our priest, well, he was out, he'd been on a long mission from Ireland, converting the Anglo-Saxons, or those that remained who had not converted. And he was out walking in the moors of Derbyshire. And it was quite late in the year. It was getting on to winter. And he was walking for a few days. He would walk and set the camp up and make a fire and go to sleep. Eat in the morning and start walking again. That's what priests do. I'm, I'm pretty certain they are very good at walk. And... Well, it started to snow. There was a very heavy storm came over. And it snowed and snowed and snowed. And the snow got higher. And well, he, he got a bit concerned and in the distance on the moor he saw one tree. And he thought, I'd best take shelter under that tree. And he did this. He walked over the tree in the blizzard-like snow. And when he got to the tree, to his amazement, he saw that there was already some people there. There was two young Saxon warriors and two young Saxon maids, ladies. And they took shelter, all five of them, under that tree. And the snow continued, and it kept on snowing, until eventually it got quite high. And, well, the young two warriors and the young two maids, Saxon maids and warriors, well, they became quite nervous and scared. For on that day, it was a Sunday, and they was on, off to church. And, well, they're not got made it, simply because of the snow. And they thought that they'll be buried alive, and they'll never see the next day. So to this, the priest decided that to calm him down, he would marry him. He said, I will marry you if you're so scared. And, well, both the couple just decided that they would agree to this. And he made up this rhyme, did our priest. Under a tree, in stormy weather, I married this man and made it together. Let him alone, who rules the thunder, put this man and made a sunder. And that is the end of our folk tale from Derbyshire. And we don't know what happened afterwards, whether the priest and the two young couples survived. I assume they did. And if you read accounts of history of people being trapped in the snow, well, you'll often read of maids and men being trapped under trees, completely covered in snow for a few days, and still managing somehow to breathe and survive. And that has happened many a time in history. And I can highly recommend a book called Freak Weather, which has many accounts of these. Now, if you enjoyed this folk tale, then you know what to do. Please leave a comment and like the video. And above all, share it with your friends and your relatives. And it's goodbye from me, Raggy, as always your host. Russ Hale, and goodbye.